فقد راح عليه قال هذا من عمل الشيطان سو اوزا لثلاث وثلاث ذات تايم هي وطن بروفيت سو هي سيد ذات ات هابن اكسيدنتلي اي نيفر انتندد تو كيل ذس جاي اند ذن فيرو هي سمند هيز بيبل مين ذا كابينت اند ذير واز ان ايمرجنسي مين ايمرجنسي مين ات واز ديسايدد ذات بيس ار ماست بي براد تو جستس اند وات جستس تو هيم سو ذير واز ا مسلم جاي هي واز also sitting there in the cabinet left to mu imana he was considering and hiding his iman but he was a mu'min so he came to musa alayhi salam wa salam min al-mara ya tamirun bikari ya tamirun wa khafr inni laka min al-nasihin that the cabinet meeting already decided they are planning and plotting to kill you so i am giving you an advice get out of the area so musa alayhi salam wa salam and until that time he has never been out from egypt so he said where should i go but anyhow He started walking in a direction and he said, "Asa, Rabbi, ayyani ani sabaz sabil." Maybe Allah Subhanahu wa Taala will give me a way out. So he was walking and walking and walking all the way from Egypt. So he came to an area. There he saw that some people they are bringing their herds and their cattle and they are watering them. Wo bajadam indu ne humra dene tabuda. But two young girls and young ladies. They were, they were stopping and preventing their cattle and their goats and lambs to come close to the water. So Musa alayhi salatu was salam. He was thinking about that. That what's the problem? Our people are bringing their herds and they are watering them, but these two girls they are not allowing their cattle to come close to the water. So he came to them and he was looking at the ground and he said, "Ma khatmu kuma." What's your story? People are watering, but you people are not. Kara ma khatmu kuma. قال تعالى نسي حتى يصدر الرعاء وأمور الشيخ الكبير يصدر الشيخ الكبير. so they both said that actually we cannot mingle with the with the strange man. if the strange man appears, there is no problem. this is the Sheikh Mubarak. well who? Sheikh Mubarak. and they said we got the Musa Islam was from Austria. so they were thinking that maybe this strange man is not thinking what about the breaking the cattle. so what happened to your brother or father? So they said to our Muna Sheikh Mujahid, "Then our father is a Sheikh Mujahid. So Sheikh number one, Mantaam, who is too much cater, and Sheikh number two, who is a great man. But our Muna Sheikh, so he is busy in his job. So that's why he uh, he cannot do that, and we are very bad. So Musa Al-Salam was Salam said, 'Okay, so we are. I am going to water your cater. So he watered their cater. When they went back, so Sheikh Al-Salam was Salam he asked about." So one of them told the whole story that there was a man. He was a, his look was a strange look. So he is not looking from the area. Also, his dialect was a different uh, uh, dialect. So he was not from the area. So Shaykh Abdul Salam was Salam said that maybe he is not known to anybody. He does not know anybody. We should give him some services. So he said that one of you should go and bring the guy to the home. So then one of them she came. So one of them came, tamri tamshi alistahia with haya and with not a decency. She was coming. Sayyid na Omar Rabi Jalla wa Dala Hamse wa Lam Takul Dal Lajatan Dal Lajatan Kani Sayyidna Aliyoh. That she was not coming like this. Like our woman are doing that. Omar Rabi Jalla wa Dala at that time said, "What about now?" So anyhow. فجاءت إحدى ما تمشي على استحياء قالت إن أبي يبوك ليجي كاجر ما سقيت لنا ذهب ما يفعل and as she mentioned شيخ الكبير so موسى عليه السلام was thinking that number one he is an old and aged man so experienced man and number two he is a عالم شيخ الكبير so I want to see him so then he came with and فلما جاء هو قص عليه القصص قال لا تخاف موسى عليه السلام still was not knowing that I am now out of the jurisdiction Fair. He was not knowing the boundaries, so he said that it happened, and then they plotted to kill me and to hang me. So that's why I came out. So he said, "La taqa, no fear and no worry." Najat al Qalam Zalimi. This area is not in the control of Fair, so you are out of that area. And then one of them said to her father, "Let me have this kajir, Baba. If you can hire him to take care of our." Yes, because this strange man, and if you will hire him, so you will get rid of the cattle, and he will take care. In the khair of Mr. Jaz Al Kabir, I mean, he is a strong man because he was the one who pulled the bucket, being pulled by twelve very strong people, but he alone pulled it. And number two, he is a man; he is very honest man. 
So uh, Ibn Abbas radiallahu ta'ala he narrates because when the lady was walking in front of Musa alayhi salam was and Musa alayhi salam was following her. So suddenly a wind came and her leg got open. The dress went a little bit up. So Musa alayhi salam was salam said that look who should be behind me. And from behind give me the direction. Yeah. And that lady she picked up the button line. That because of it, something happened to my body, and she said, so that's why I said, I don't want to see your, your leg once again. So that's why she said, in the khair of Anista Jadda, Al-Qawi, that he is the Qawi, and he is the Amin man. So you can, so Shraib alayhi salatu wa salam, he said to him, this, this, Shraib alayhi salatu wa salam, he said to Musa alayhi salatu wa salam, that, inni huridu an unki hakar hadar natayya hatayya ala anta jurani, samani hijaj. If you will take care for eight years, of my cattle, so I will make you one of my daughters. So Musa said, "Fine, But if you will complete this period as ten years, so that will be your good gesture." So Musa said, "Ayyam al ajarani qadhetu, fala hudwana alayya." That eight years or ten years, one of them I will be here, fala hudwana. But you will not go ahead to push me that stay more and stay more and stay more. Ayyab al ajalina kazetu fala hudwana alayya. And in the end, as Arab nowadays also when they are entering into contracts, so they say Allah ala Allah wakil. What do they say? Allah wakil. So they say, Wallahu ala ma nakul wakil. That Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is our wakil and he is our witness. That means the agreement is done. So then Musa alayhi salatu wa salam was there. He married the lady. And when he was going back, so Shraib alayhi salatu wa salam gave him a stick. And that is the famous stick. Of Musa alayhi salatu wa salam. That when he was going back and he was there in Sinai Desert. And he saw a fire there on the top of a tree. And he went there to make the long story short. There from the fire. He heard a voice. That what is in your right hand? So that was a stick known to everybody. So he said that this is my stick or my star. And I use it when I am taking care of the cattle and things like that. And he mentioned a few benefits of that stick. So Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says that al Musa. Throw it on the ground. So the moment he threw it on the ground, so it became a big python. So Musa al Salam he went to the because that is nature. Or that is a natural fear. That is not a fear of a coward eyes. But that is a natural fear from the snake. Because snake, snake that is a poisonous uh, uh, insect. So Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala said, Don't worry and don't fear. Come forward and hold it. So Musa al Salam put his hand there in the, between the jaws of the python. When again it was the same state. So Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala said, What do you think? Now, it won't either like this or like this. Because there is one word, and the other one, what no yada kaila janah. So that's why in Abbas said of Yallah Talano that these are two different voices. Number one, when he was feeling fear, so like is the bird is holding its wings when it feels fear. And its fear is done. So Musa was going to a big pharaoh and a big kafir. So Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala said that anytime you feel fear, so just be like this a bird. So you will be strong, like a very strong man. And that was happening. Here from your jab, into your hands, it will be shining like the, sun, the shining sun. So now you have to go to Fir'aun, Isa bila Fir'auna, inna dhubwa. So anyhow, this is Sayyidina Shu'ayb, alayhi salatu wa taslima. And that stick is attributed to Sayyidina Shu'ayb, alayhi salatu wa salam. We are lucky that we are here. And our brother, he mentioned that is Prophet Shu'ayb. And we are of the belief that the Rahman, mercy of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, salakim is coming down constantly and continuously. So in this regard, we can say when we are standing here, that rahma, we are getting some portion of that as well. So may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala bless all of you, may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala bless all of you.